Give it just a second. And are we there? Yeah, I think we're live. Oh, we're live. Oh, good morning, everyone. Look who we're here. We are. We're so excited. <laughs> Look at my friends. <laughs> so this is Terry and this is Tina. And we are actually in their beautiful cross-stitch store. You're in for such a treat today. We're going to we're gonna talk a little bit about some stuff going on here, but then Liz is gonna take you on a tour around the store. If you've never been here, allow a lot of hours <laughs> and make sure you bring your credit cards. I'm just saying. <laughs> and not your this. spouse. No, leave him at home. No, don't, don't bring him. Kissing just the you and your friends. And spouse. And it, yeah, yeah, don't do it. But I, I have to ask you girls, what year did you open here? September 26th, 1984. It was 84, because I was trying to remember that, because I actually met you two at the little house. Oh, really? Oh, really? really? Yes. Wow. I met you there years and years ago, and then um, I started coming over here when you guys were here. In fact, I have something to show you guys. Oh, you did you, bring it. Okay, I did I bring it. Oh, you're going to get a chuckle. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if you're ready for this or not, girls. Oh, but, my God. Oh. Look at that. <laughs> do you remember that? I do. I know. So, I do. So a baby sample. Show you this. Look at the look at the year. Look at the year. This was done in so this was my Brooks, and Brooke was born in 1981. Wow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. wow. And I think you two were over there in the other yep. store. Now I may not have made this right in 81. It may have been a couple of years after. No, because a couple of years after my twins were born. Yeah. And we would come down here. I'd bring them in in their little stroller. They'd go back in the playroom and then they'd sit there and play. That's right. So no, I have known fun. these beautiful women for a lot of years. And they're, they're always so kind and so helpful. Anytime you come in Thank and you. so talented. Oh, my gosh. You're so nice. Very no, nice. I'm, I'm just truthful. These two ladies are amazing. I'm happy to call them my friends. So, so we... Um, we obviously at our store, we do not do what they do here, but we have started doing their bags. <laughs> yes, and we yes. love the bags, but we always tell people, oh, when you come in and you think this is good, we have a place for you. <laughs> <laughs> we have a place. In fact, yesterday we had four ladies come in and they had been here. Mm -hmm. Oh, they were, uh, yeah, they were on their George. way out. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah they were. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so they, they came in and they were, they were like, Shepherd's <laughs> Yeah, but your store is your fantastic. Store. Well, but we're, we're different. We're we different. are different. We're different. Yeah. But I love that we can do things together. I love too, that too. So it's but so a bolt good. of fabric takes up a lot more space than a skein of yarn and a, or a skein of floss. That's and true. You know, mm -hmm. so it just feels like they've got so much to look at. Oh, and, they do <laughs> have. And I feel like that at our store, but here. Oh, but not yeah, you but have lots. here. It's like beautiful. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and so and, nicely decorated oh, and so beautiful. Just, thank you. You do such they a good do. job. It's gorgeous. So I'm going to shimmy over to the side. And, and me uh, too. Oh, <laughs> yes. and you guys I, are beautiful. You guys are So I want Terry to talk a little bit about her bags. And, and then we'll talk about some other things as well. But I'm going to shimmy over here. <laughs> so there's room yes. to show. All right, lovey, you're on. All right. So, um... About a year ago, I guess, the Fat Quarter Shop came out with these plaid bags, and we just thought they were so fun because they were affordable and great, and then we had this great idea to put stitching on the bags. Because so, why wouldn't you? Because, this, yep, it's a perfect thing to do. So the bag is gridded, just like cross-stitch fabric, and so we decided to start with, this was our first one that we did, stitch. So and instead beautiful. of using floss, we wanted to use pearl cotton. And pearl cotton is just different. It is... Let me give them a little up-close look at stitch. Oh, there okay. you go. Do you see how gorgeous Isn't it that beautiful? is? Oh, it's so pretty. <laughs> so this one doesn't have buttons. No. Nope, the first not two did not have buttons. Oh, mm -mm. mm -mm. mm -mm. I need to do this one. I love the buttons. You do need this to do that. Well, I was worried that the buttons would catch. Or rip or break. Yeah. 
But then, have you had any trouble with that? Have Zero. you had any customers Zero. come in? Oh, good. So the first two so were cute. Stitch and Scary. scary. I love okay, scary. Okay, let's go let's show Scary. Let's go show Scary. scary. Of course, I love Scary. Mm. So and and, then and it's the season for Scary. It is. It is. It is the season, the season for Scary. Season. Uh -huh. So then we had a group of gals back, back for a little mini retreat, and they're like, well, we want buttons on them. Mm. And so I thought, okay. Let's do oh, it. So tell them what kind so of buttons you use. We use the buttons from Just Another Button Company. Yes. And there's a gazillion buttons. Later when we go on our tour, we can yes. pull out the drawer. Yes. <laughs> Yay! Sure. There are sure. thousands of buttons. Yes. And they're kind. So Joy was the next bag we did. And... It has buttons. <laughs> I have to move it so it's the right side. I know, right? Sorry. 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 <laughs> so this one has buttons. And the Just Another Button Company um, are very nice about... Packing the little packs yes. of buttons for us, so we don't have to pack them ourselves, which I love. All right, going back to the pearl cotton, instead of using floss, which you could, but it's not nice. So just, <laughs> so just move and tell on them why that. it's not nice. All right, so the floss has different strands, so it has like six little strands, and when you stitch it on the bags, then you run the risk of snagging one of those strands, and it'll pull out, <laughs> and then you're going to be like, crap, now what do I do? Oh, sorry, should I you could say that. It's okay. <laughs> Don't say the S word. But all right. It's just fine. <laughs> I mean, you can. You can say whatever you okay. want to because no, no. we're all cool with that. So, um, pearl cotton comes like this. It comes in little skeins and it's a thick thread and it's just fabulous mm -hmm. to work yes, with. Yes, I agree. And I once you yes. work with it, you really won't go back. I promise you because the pearl cotton is just really, really nice. Now, pearl cotton comes in different weights, just so you have to make sure you get a number five when you're doing the bags. So, Terry, how many strands of floss would a number five equal? Like three or four. Three or four. Okay. But don't do floss. But don't do floss. Don't do floss. Just do say pearl cotton. But I've kind of wondered, you yeah. know, on the different numbers, how, how, many, how many strands, strands of floss it would take to equal that. Three or four. Okay. I like okay. three because then you have three other strands. Oh, so you're perfect. not like taking out oh, four and then lean, lining up. I don't know. That's, that's too fussy. Yeah, for it's me. too fussy. And, and just do the pearl cotton. Just do <laughs> yes, the pearl cotton. yes. Just do pearl cotton. Especially because you can buy kits. Yes, complete that's kits. True. Look at this. That's true. So oh, then you don't even this. have to think about it. Look at this. Okay, this is their newest one. This is autumn, and is that not gorgeous? <laughs> I love you. autumn. But look at this, you guys. Everything is in there except your bag. So all you would need to purchase to go along with this bag is the bag, and they've got all of your floss. Look at the cute little button pack in there. Mm -hmm. Add a needle. And, and a needle. So everything is in, well, scissors and a bag. Right. That's all you need to put in right. there for your to-go project. So this and is the one that. we're showing. But you got to see this cute, can you see this cute scissor fob? Or a yeah, zipper yeah, fob? Here. Look how cute it is. But you have to see the for real one. Look okay, at this. so when you stitch mm -hmm. it on the bag, it turns out as big as a bag. And when you stitch it on 32 count linen, it's going to turn out the size of this little tiny. A little tiny. So beautiful. We always, well, that's the pattern of the bag. And then we yes. always give a little scissor fob as well. Look so at this. you have a whole complete set that you can put in your bag with a pin cushion and a scissor fob. And then we find scissors that match. So these Look are little that. acorn scissors. So and Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> I love they make me laugh. Uh, so I have to tell you. So so Terry kind of did one for us. Did I? Oh, quilt. Oh, I did do quilt well for you guys. You quilt for That's us. That's true. And so, <laughs> so we were kind of talking, and she's like, oh, I think we need to do something together. So she did a quilt bag. <laughs> I stitched that, and I also stitched the pin cushion and oh, the scissor box. Oh, yay. It took me longer to do the <laughs> pin cushion and the scissor because it's itty bitty, and I had to use my magnifiers <laughs> and my bifocals and all those things to make it work. All right, so but there's kits that. for those too. Yes, there are kits yeah. for. So all. there's they that. do an amazing job here of so putting then, together kits. There's the little kit. Look how. Cute. And then that gives you the backing fabric, that. the chenille or the ribbon, what depending on what I've used, the threads. It's and then the pattern there. is in the pattern. It's all right so there. Cute. It's all right so, there. And then so, so the quilt look at how scissors cute. are little look at that. blue and green ones, so they match quilt. Um, Aren't they so pretty? Queen scissors are bee scissors. Of course they are, because you've got to be queen bee. Of course. Bee. 
Of course. <laughs> of course. Ah, they're just so fun. they've kitted all of those fun things for you, so they're just all ready to go. It's just easy to come in here, you pick up a kit, you pick up a pattern, and out the door you go. That's and right. you're ready to stitch, so we love And we, we love do that. have the bags at our store, some of them. We don't, do. I don't, do we have all of them? Of course you do. We do, yeah. We I do have all of yes, them. Yes, yeah. Every time they come out with a new pattern, in fact, I kind of harass her a little bit. I say, is it ready? Is it done? Is it done? Is it done? Is it done? Fran, I'll call you. Simmer down, girl. Simmer down. I'll let you know when it's ready. Because so. cross-stitchers use project bags. Quilters use project yes. bags. Yes. Appliqueers use project bags. Who doesn't need Who a project bag? I know. Bag? I know. Who? The knitting group is... Hot on button. <laughs> oh, oh, of course. Of course. Like, okay. You're like, all right, I'll, I'll get Let's on that. Let's see if we've but got we any comments love, really quick. We love the bags that they do here. They're they're just beautiful. They're fun they're, and they're and easy. they work up fast. And they work. They up work fast. up really really fast. So, um, if you've never tried a cross stitch project, I would say this is an excellent one. Yeah, to start. An yes, that's me. That's, yeah, me. that's me. That's <laughs> me. This is pick me. So they do. They work up very quickly, um, and they're just beautiful. And every place I take mine, everybody says, "Huh? Where did you get that bag? What you made that? Well, how did you do that?" So do sh show us a couple of tricks, because okay. I know you have some for doing so, this. So um, when I start a bag, I'll start it so it's not like on the right side. So I just fold my bag. So I'm noticing you're not pulling the bottom out, though. You're leaving No, it out. because this Good is what girl. you see. Yes. I mean, that's see. where it's centered. If you do it this way, then your whole it's design is going to be bottom. way down. Mm -hmm. And that won't work. No, that'll be ugly. So just leave it as it is. Mm -hmm. Fold it in fourths. Look at that. And then pinch it right there. And then that's where your center is. And that's where you're going to start your design. So I just stick a needle in there, and then away we go. So no, one, you can't show that because oh, that's the graph. Oh, 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 don't show that. Oh, yeah. oh, well, and there you. are arrows so on I, your design. Yeah, that's what I wanted to There are to arrows show on you. your design, and so that points to the center. Points to the center. So, yeah, thank you. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh good. But, no. so, I, so, so, thank you. Then you're going to start here. And I know some people say they stitch them upside down. That makes me crazy. So, I don't. Oh, I just crumple, crumple it up, up. Mm -hmm. and... I just crumple it up like this and stitch like that. And it doesn't ruin the bag. It nope, doesn't show. Because it just pops right back. Not yeah. at all. And really, you can just crumple, 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 mm -hmm. and then get in there and just, I usually sew from the top, but some people will go back and forth. It just doesn't matter. What hour are you to get this up? Oh, no, you're there, you, there you go. I know. There you are. There you are. Yeah, so I those are that. my tips. Using pearl cotton yes. and just be brave. You're stitching this, you're not stitching this over one thread. No. You're stitching it over two. two. So that's how you stitch linen when you're cross-stitching. So that means you're stitching over two little little threads and up two little threads. Mm -hmm. And if you look really carefully, I don't know if I can get it in there closely, you can see how that's done. If you do it over one, it works, but your design it's is really tiny. tiny. So how long a length of um, pearl cottons do you like to cut and work with? Because I know sometimes if you're working with too long a piece, it's going to get ugly. Right. So what, what's a good standard length? Well, the way we open the pearl cottons, and maybe I'll just go get a skein and open it for you. So you talk for a minute. Oh, <laughs> we can talk for a minute. Well, what I was going to say mm -hmm. is what I like um, mm -hmm. is that... While you're working on it, the pattern fits in the bag. Yes. Your scissors, all of your things. So when you're working on it, it's like mm -hmm. a complete capsule project. It is. And I just took a trip to Texas, and it was super easy for me to just throw that in my suitcase, mm -hmm. and I just had it ready to go, and I didn't worry about stuff falling out. No. I didn't worry about losing things, yes. and so. Because they just zipper up. Shit. It was lovely. I think that is just. And look how such cute. a fun. Look at this, how cute they've even put a cute. Yeah. This is, I don't know if Have you can see this. This is a little squirrel zipper pull. Can you see how stinking cute on Acorn? I don't we're think we've shown sheep. sheep yet. Well, and the other thing, too, is if you have a particular color that you like, you can do different color bags on different oh, patterns. Sure. Oh, and wait, wait. Here's another really important thing for you. If you come down here to Shepherd's Bush 
and you have a pattern, you don't really love the colors that they've used in it. What? These, <laughs> what? It never happens. She's like, that. stop that. These girls are amazing at taking a pattern and changing up colors, and, and they are happy to help you with any colors, you know, if, if and, and, and they've changed a lot. Like, they'll get a pattern from someone else. They have their own amazing patterns. But they, a lot of times, will get a pattern from someone else and change it up to be Shepherd's Bush's colors, which I always like better. I always <laughs> like you. their choices thank better. You, thank so you. show us how you do this, okay. ma'am, please. So here's a pearl cotton skein. Mm -hmm. Do you get told yes, ma'am. <laughs> I'm the keeper of the scissors. <laughs> All right. So here's your pearl cotton skein. One end has two loops. Some of the girls call them bunny ears. And one end has one loop. So you stick your finger in the loop and you pull it all the way through. So if you don't do it this way, then they end up into a giant tangled mess and you spend an hour undoing every single skein. Which you want to be stitching, not yeah, undoing you don't want thread. To undo so then somewhere in the skein is this little knot thing. So I know you're going to panic, but it's okay. You just cut all the way through that. And then if the knot is left, cut all the way through that. On the knot end. On the knot end. Scissors. Okay, so now you have, it looks kind of like this, okay? So I pull it through one more time, like that. And then you have a working length. So that is the size that you use, and it's already clipped at both ends, so you're just now going to pull one. Right. That's what I do, too. Nice. So then I just loop it. So it keeps my tags on because you want to know what color it is. And some people will put them on like floss, floss drops. drops. And there are a lot of different floss drops out there that are fun. But nice. Um, that's nice. Mine look that's like a this. Great, that's a good it's tip. A great tip. It's a great tip. It is a great that tip. That is just the best. I like that. Because then they're all the same size. You're not worried about... Oh, from my nose to here. That's oh, right. That's, that's or, a yard. or when you untangle it, then somebody has to hold it, and you have to unwrap it, and then wrap it on a bobbin, and then that's and a it's lot all of work. That, that's no, too, just that's just too much time. That this is so stitching. fast. That yeah. was really this is fast. a huge tip. That was a great tip. Thank you for that. So we hope that you can see all of these beautiful. We'll maybe bags. zoom in a little bit on our so tour. Here's oh, yes. Queen. Oh yeah, we need oh, to see Queen. I'm almost done with this back. Are you? Queen is almost. I love Queen. I love Queen. I do love and Queen. The, it's so beautiful. I'm a bee person, so I love Queen. It's and good. then sheep, and of course. Sheep. Oh wait, I don't think we're showing winter. I think that's the only one oh, we haven't oh, shown. Oh, oh, we haven't shown these two down here. This year, I've been working through the seasons, so winter. Yes. Because our winter went from about oh. November of last oh, year to May, June. It was so. We had snow. snow the end of oh, May. Oh, not, oh, one of the ski areas had over 900 inches of snow <laughs> this, year, that this was last amazing. year. That was and amazing. we're not complaining because we wanted we it. We needed the moisture. We needed that. Sure so here's Har's for Valentine's Har. Day. And spring. Oh, this one's I so love cute. Down. Now, I'm sorry summer was... I don't know. Summer just went away. <laughs> but but it'll come out next year. I was going to say, and but it's there's, there's really cute. Oh, <laughs> what color are you doing it on? Tan. It'll be oh, on the tan. it will be on the tan. Oh, nice. so nice. sneaky. I just moved sneak on to autumn. Right. And, well, and that's good because autumn is so amazing. Okay, let me double check. I, we did have some comments. Oh, goodness. My fingers are in the way. Um... So my husband's watching. Oh, <laughs> Thank you, sweetheart. So um, Marianne says hello from chilly Florida. Did wow, it get cold? Hi, is it cold? really chilly or is that just a joke? <laughs> wow. um, Pam Davis is watching. Oh, Brian Kingsley is husband. watching. This is my prom for real. <laughs> Victoria Hi. Rogers is watching. Oh, Francine. Oh, I think Francine actually commented. Let me get down here. Happy to comment live. Love your Tuesday mornings. Happy oh. fall. Yes, we oh, are grateful that you, it's fall. Francine. Let's Francine see. Francine is one of my Idaho friends. Oh, oh. Weezer, Idaho is where she lives. Wow. Oh. Isn't that cute? Oh. Trisha, Idaho. Shirley, Joanne, oh, Hi, Laurie joined late. Where are you? Okay. Yeah, let's remind everyone. Where are we? Where? We are at Shepherd's Bush. Shepherd's we Bush, which Shepherd's is Bush. right off 24th Street. Give us your Street. address. 220 24th Street in downtown Ogden, Utah. Yes, and a beautiful place. And like we just said, you've been here since 1984. 39 years. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, Good party guess. next year. Are you going to have a big party next year? I know, 40. Year? 40. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty 40. exciting. Yeah. I'll, be, I'll bring you a cake. 
Oh, I'll be <laughs> September 26th. I'll bring you. Yeah, a so that's oh, what. Lawrence Lar- is a great city because we have lots of yummy restaurants. Oh, yes. And- yes. Oh, yes. There's a really good one right across the street called oh, Slant Waters. Yeah. Oh, oh, you yeah. like great pizza? It's a- Oh, it's so good. And we have a cupcake 25th. store. What? You haven't been to the cupcake store? What? Oh, my <laughs> gosh. They're fantastic. What time do they yeah. open? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where are they? Um, just up around the corner. Oh. We might have to we go check them out. Shirley Hart <laughs> says <laughs> Shepherd's Bush is awesome. No. Shauna's watching. <gasps> Pam says, oh, no, something on my want list. <laughs> yes, Pam, absolutely. Um, absolutely. Cassie's Everything watching. Christine, Marianne. Oh, the quilt store's watching. <laughs> Good morning, Donna. Donna. That's my daughter. <laughs> That's Donna. Donna. Donna, love my quilt bag. Uh, Vicky says, I need to buy the stitch kit. Yes. Yes, you, you can come here or you can come to our store. That's right. Give them your phone number. 801 399 Four, five, four, six. We'll post all that information in the post, too. But these they guys just, have it, too. They have all the supplies. Yes, but, but you could get cute kits and everything for it. <laughs> right here, already made. And these girls are really good with shipping. They ship all over the world. We do. They really do. They're, they they do so many amazing things here, you guys. We could be on here all day long with you, with me trying to tell you, and I'd still miss it. <laughs> and, and we need to, you need to have the tour. So we'll yeah, do, do that next tour. because... You, you need it. to see. I think you won't believe um, it. mentioning your stockings is another worthy oh. thing to mention. Oh, and maybe th- th- when we get over there on the tour, we'll what mention. What year okay. did you first start those stockings? Oh, Tina's not here. Tina no left idea. us. Okay, okay. Um, oh, there you are. <laughs> Voice. Oh, there you are. What year did you start with? Nineteen ninety. Nineteen ninety. Yeah, because so well, how old was he? Something different for Peter. Well, Peter. In his picture is about three. Yeah. Okay. So at the beginning wow. we sh- we did family. Well, they're all family they're stockings, all but family. Mm-hmm. um. Oh, wait so there are him. pictures of Peter and Christian, and then mm-hmm. nieces and nephews, and I'm finally going to make a couple of them. Are you? I, I am because so now I don't have to make them for all my kids. That's true. <laughs> I can just make them for Stan and I. I love that idea. Oh, there, you that idea. there you go. And you also Dude. use the pearl cotton on those. Yes. So oh, wait until you see the stockings. So yeah. I'm going to let you two. Yeah, let's do a tour. Now. We're going to let's have a little bit of an earthquake here for a minute while I readjust. <laughs> and we're going to look at that. <laughs> oh, look at Yes, you can see our little oh, car is going by. Room. Yeah, look at that. Hold on, guys. We're just close your eyes for a minute. Lizzie's, Lizzie's working oh, on it. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay. So now I'm just going to flip the camera and follow you. So wherever you go, I go. Are we ready? Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. Here we go. So we're going to actually, you can go you, right here and then we're going to turn around. Okay. We, we change out the front of the shop for whatever holiday is coming. So, of course, here's Halloween. Oh. And then I always do a little, little teaser of Christmas. So these are all just fun little Halloween pieces. Look at those. But there's lots beautiful. more. So. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's oh lots. yeah. And then here's Christmas. Oh, look at this bear. I like him. Just Deck forever and always. Halls. So um, my, my biggest switch around is Christmas and Halloween because everything in the whole shop moves. All there the we go. I think that's going to. And all the. And them. So scan down this. Show them all these beautiful oh, cabinets. So this I mean, is this all is floss. Just, mm-hmm, a little. So these are overdyed Weak Star Works threads. I should have um, straightened them. But no. <laughs> no. No. And they're all done alphabetically. So we have three main lines of overdyed threads. Weeks, samplers, and classic colors. Then these are the DMCs, which... So if they don't have a color, you probably don't need it. This is true. This is true. Let's walk slow so we don't make everyone sick. Every year, Prairie Schooler does a Santa. Come back, Santa. And it's a little card. And then we do it on a great big fabric, which is a number seven fabric. And then we use the pearl cotton. We a bigger pearl cotton. It's a number three pearl. Again, we have a kit. Because we are we big into kits. 
Because then it makes it just so handy to just yes. come in, pick it up, pick it up and you've got it. Right. So and then, gorgeous. and I love the big stuff. Or you can go to friends. <laughs> <laughs> fun fabric. We carry a tiny bit of fabric for pillows, but that's about it. And did you show them? This is just a teensy, teensy, <laughs> tiny bit of patterns. You guys, there's patterns in here. Every sampler that they have hanging up on the walls. They always have the patterns for those. And if they're out of them, they're so good to quickly order them. Okay. They, they're they really good to order them in for oh, yeah. you. So there's the winter display. And, and it goes high up to the ceiling. Mm -hmm. and, and Thanksgiving mm -hmm. goes, then Christmas comes out, and I do a little wall of winter. Isn't it beautiful? So okay. you like to get on ladders. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Displays. Look and at the tree. We, I love we the tree. We decorate the tree for whatever holiday. So it could be Halloween, it could be Christmas, it could be Valentine's Day, Easter. Don't you guys just want all of this in your house? I, I know. Do, do you? I do. Yeah, I do. <laughs> It's all here and we're here every day. So. I keep collecting. I keep collecting. Well, you guys know that. I, every oh. time I come down, oh, yep, I need to do that. Then I take it home. I take it out of my bag and I this look at it and I one. cut it and then I <laughs> put it back in my bag. This oh, is look a, how vibrant those is colors a Utah are. designer called Autumn Lane and oh, it's a husband and wife team. Oh, and well, it's actually cute. the husband that really does, I think, the, the designs. The designs. But um, they're fun. Oh, look at this little cat on pumpkins. That's a Chessie and me. Oh, it's a little so kit, and they come cute. with all the threads. Nope, that's a similar one. I hope you guys can see that there's no way I'm going to be able to catch everything on camera. So you, you just have to, have to come in. in. Yeah, yeah, this, the one she's showing now in. is the Blackbird one with all the different squares. So Blackbird gals are quilters, and so that's what they have done with the one with the multicolored fabrics. Here's another B one. Like a patchwork. Cute. So is that an individual pattern? Is that in a book? What Each one is an individual pattern. Each oh, square. That's so pretty. I don't think I've seen that one. Really? It's, it's such a pretty one. It's beautiful. And then this is another. And there's Tina again. Of <laughs> Eve of Easter. <laughs> <laughs> no, could be Halloween. Could be Easter. Oh. Could be Halloween. And do you know, this is a fact, Halloween is the second most decorated. Is it? Oh. Holiday. Mm -hmm. after Christmas. Right after Christmas. Mm -hmm. it, that it, doesn't surprise me. That doesn't surprise me. I and think Halloween is our biggest stitching holiday. Bigger than Christmas. Is it bigger than Christmas even? Really? So. Oh, that's interesting. That but I never want to lose sight of fall or Thanksgiving. Oh, so oh. please. Then we have an oh. autumn display. And then pretty soon... The bags on the display that you just saw are going away, and it'll come out for Thanksgiving. Look at this cute pumpkin right there. Isn't that fun? Oh, my gosh. I love that one. Look at, do you see the little houses? Look at these little houses. Look at how beautiful those, those are. Those are Plum Street, are. and they, they are called Salt Fox Samplers. Oh, Salt Fox so houses. pretty. And aren't they cute? They're, they're supposed beautiful. to, they look like, um, yeah, photographs. So then we frame them so they look like photos. Oh, <laughs> nice. And they're oh, framing goodness. here, you guys. You need to, as Liz is showing you some yeah, of these. Oh, my word. Really oh, There's another Santa up frames. there. Yep. So you don't yes. have to do it in a pillow if you wouldn't want to. No. Nope. No. No, it doesn't well hang. But look at all of their, look at all of the beautiful ones that are up here along the wall. Okay. Now turn around. Mm. So then we have a whole oh, slowly. Of fabrics. Oh, slowly. Mm. These are overdyed you fabrics. Come in. You can come in. <laughs> so these are fabrics come in. that are like dyed and overdyed. <laughs> and just, a lot, just a lot of variety of different ones in different counts from 28, 32, 36, 40, 46. <clears throat> Those are not our measurements, though. No. <laughs> <laughs> I wish 32, 24, 36. But, oh, whatever it is. And then here are the different patterns. These are new patterns that are better new. <laughs> oh, Nicely displayed. Did you see this? You should show them. Oh, this. and this floss. Oh, here's the, this. This is, these oh, are our sample this. threads. Mm -hmm. So, again, an overdyed thread. Mm -hmm. They were kind of the first of the overdyed threads that, that came out, and 
beautiful colors. So it's fun to have them out in a cupboard like yeah, that. I oh, love so you can I see love it. This display cupboard. Yeah. This is so perfect for those. Take up a lot of room. Yeah. <laughs> but we love it. But the, the cabinet itself is so it's cute. cute. <laughs> Isn't that so fun? Look at that. I just painted that. Isn't it cute? <laughs> did you guys paint yourself? Yeah. Oh, oh. It's so cute. Of course you did, because look at the little sheets. Oh, so cute. It's in the oh, it's so pretty. So then back here is our fabric section. So we carry linens, Aida's. All sorts of different, and Luganas, even weaves, just all sorts of different counter thread linens and fabric. So, and then on these walls are our kits, the Shepherd's Bush kits. Look at these. So, they so these are all patterns you've designed? Right, yes. Aren't they gorgeous? See why I love their coloring? Their colors are just so, they're soft and they're just. I, I just love how they put their colors together for Thank theirs. You. Oh, I just love this so one. Isn't it pretty? All sorts of different stitches. So by the end of the time, you've learned a lot of new and different things that you might not have tried before. But a sampler's fun because you if you don't like a stitch... You don't have to do it by the end of the row. You're done. You're done. <laughs> <Move it. laughs> Oh. These are all kits that are come come with silk threads, cotton threads, buttons, whatever is in the kit, you get it, except for the framing. Now here are the stockings, oh, stockings. that Fran was asked, talking oh, about. Look at those. And we've done them all every year. I'll just see when Peter was done. Let's just see. Peter's. 1994. Oh, so 20 years. 20 years, girls. So we should have. So do you just do one a year then? 20 years, 40, 30 years. 30 years. 30 years. So do you just do one a year? One a year. One and we year. alternate boy and girl. Oh, nice. So this year it'll be a girl. Nice. And when do those patterns come out? Um, when we get them done. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and don't harass her. But guess what? Done. The new one is not out yet, but the there's plenty to choose oh from, gosh. especially if you haven't done one. Look at this one. I love Parker. So the girls are mostly all girls, but you can stitch a, a Santa for any of the. Oh, yeah. Sure so could. we kind of have Santa oh, ones, them. and then we also have like nativity kind of ones. So like wise men, shepherds, angels. They're gorgeous. They're just so pretty. And they're all just fun they're and just different. Beautiful. And Look at all those fun ones. You really need to come see oh, you yourself. Do. We can't you, give you, you the you, the yeah. camera just loses perspective. Mm -hmm. You got to come see. You really do. You just really do. They are so just the so amazing. I think my kids would love these. These are nice big stockings. Well, yeah, <laughs> you get a lot of sto stuff. Right, <laughs> right. You can big. get whole packages of macaroni mm -hmm. and cheese in them. <laughs> oh, well, well, I was just thinking how expensive it is to fill a stocking this size. But if I'm putting a box of macaroni and yeah. cheese in there, <laughs> macaroni and, cheese, cheese. and they'd be socks and top ramen. Top I ramen. like that. Socks in the corner. Nice. And, the corner. and an orange. Got an orange. orange. Oh, got yeah. Orange. Got orange. Those oh, are so, so gorgeous. They are. See, the talent that goes into those is just. Mm. So when you decide you're going to design something, how do you do it? Do you sit down and you draw out something first? Do you do a graphing chart? How do you, how, what's your process for designing? Well, um, generally I will sketch it on a paper. Okay. And then I will sketch it on graph paper. And then I will stitch it, and then I will graph it on the computer. Okay. So the nice. computer Lots graphing of steps. is the very last thing. After nice. you know you love it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's what your pattern actually comes out looking. That's right. from your computer. Mm -hmm. right. they're, they're, I mean, these girls have perfected how they do that. So In the olden days, this. we did it by hand, and Tina was really good at that. I was not. I was a messier writer, so... I was happy to move on to, <laughs> to the computer. <laughs> I, I'd, I'd still be like, to, I'd still be doing all the fun hand stuff. And Jean, do you want to say how you design? The very same way. The same way, she <laughs> says. The very same way. I bet nice. Very nice. Very nice. So, yeah, those are the gorgeous. Now, you have to come look back in here because, oh, 
Oh, so many beautiful things. So many pretty things. Oh my gosh, I see these. Look at look at these beautiful spools up there. Oh, I love those old-fashioned dippies. Oh, do you know what I actually did? So I was binding a huge quilt. I have a, it's a smaller one than this one right here, uh -huh. but it's that same shape. I made my binding. I wrapped my binding all the way around that wooden spool, set it there by my sewing machine. So as How I'm binding, fun. I'm just pulling it up. Oh, and, it's oh, okay. and it's not a big twisted heaping mess on the floor. That is such a great idea. idea. It was, and it was so cute sitting on that yeah. spool. It was so cute. I so use I toilet paper, paper rolls. <laughs> I think I need to find me one of those. <laughs> maybe, maybe, yeah. I know that they have had them before. Oh, we'll actually, have to go check it yeah, out. We'll have to see if Donna's got some, or give us a call when she gets some back in. So I'm cute. Sorry, Here, we go. Here we are. Let's go look at some more. Oh, you should you should look up in this area at all of their fun little notiony things too that go along. Straight up there. Oh, That's no, okay. Not. It's beautiful. We it's don't have beautiful. to hit every nook and cranny because we, they just have to come in. Oh, they really okay, so do. So yeah. back where you see all the pictures, clear back. That's where Halloween usually lives. So everything. Well, you can still see some of the Halloween things at the top because I didn't didn't get them down. But anyway. So but that whole fun. wall comes down. So it's you you have Halloween all year round. Well you have oh, all yeah, holidays all, all year round. It just moves it. around it just moves around to focus areas. So if we go up here Oh, did you see all the beads? Look at oh. this. I mean they have punch needle patterns. They have a cute well, so I can see a box with a few in there. We've that's, had a punch needle important. class, so I think it's mm -hmm, mm -hmm. it's getting. I'll, I'll tell them come up here because you guys have some patterns. Yeah, too. we do. So lots of beads. They have all so kinds here, of really like cute scissors, love and Halloween, not Halloween, love and val or Valentine things and wedding things. So these will get love. together in in that nice. time of the year. Look at how beautiful. Then we always have. A little sheep oh. section. <gasps> Baby got backstitched. That's <laughs> hilarious. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's a heart I love in our home that love mm, I love that one too. I love that. And then beautiful. these are fun. So these are pretty. new. This is um, Tiny Towns, and we've been stitching those. Those are heart and hand. And Cute. they have been super popular. She does them for all the different holidays right holidays. now. So I'm hoping yeah. she'll go on to seasons. One of, one of our gals came down and picked one up. Um, Debbie came down and got one, but I can't remember which one it was, but she came back and showed us all. It was so cute. So if you go back and look at the Chris or the Halloween section, there's one right in the room. Oh, oh. Halloween one. so I'm and sure I Christmas showed that. One and nice. Oh, back here, oh and I love fun. these big. Oh, this is what we do for kids. So we do a whole oh, line kids. of kits oh, for kids. Nice. That's so such a good we idea. We start them about five, six, six to oh, ten are the perfect age because they get how to make X's. So do you guys do a class with little kids? Mm -hmm. We used to. We started with okay. thousands of classes, but now we just, you with just the whole design. wholesale end of our business, we just don't yeah, have the right. time yeah. and, and, and the space. And the space. Yeah. Because I remember going back in your mailing room, doing the yeah. classes. Doing yeah, that's classes what, where our classroom room. was. But yeah. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. yeah. No, no, we're not no, going in there. No. Okay. We, we don't need to. That's private. So this is usually oh, a huge gosh. Christmas wall. And you mm. can see it's a mix between Christmas and other yeah. stuff. Oh, so until really Christmas beautiful. all comes out, then all these Christmas pieces will go out where Halloween is. Then up top are the Thanksgiving pieces. Which I love Thanksgiving. So I do too. It's just I a gentle, too. calm holiday. It is. Well, and I feel like Thanksgiving things are usually good through all of fall. Yes. Like you can really yes. leave them out. If you don't want to decorate for Halloween, you can decorate for Thanksgiving and mm -hmm. leave it out all year till you pull it down for Christmas. And so show them these beautiful cabinets. So these are pearl cottons. Look at all our choices, guys. So this is where the, the threads are for the bags. If you choose not to buy a kit with all of those uh -huh. thread you might kits. Want to do yeah. And if I you mean, do, you have the perfect people to help. <laughs> oh, if you happen to have an aversion to purple or something. <laughs> <laughs> Some people, you know, I mean, 
No. Not, not You're a not a purple thing? No. Oh, my gosh. I don't like pink either. No. <laughs> But she I loves know. red. <laughs> so here are the fourth. Of, this is the Fourth of July section. Oh, I love flags of so all these kinds. These little things will end Look up on the these. tree during the summer. Look at those! Aren't they beautiful? So they just they just moved back to their old home. So are these patterns that are specific to this size, or do you just smith, stitch them on smaller count well, or bigger count? That, size. that was a series that Little House did of early Americans and I was always sad. I wanted to do them like this because I wanted to have them for our tree. Mm. But I was always sad not to do them all together because all together. I think they look so I love impressive. how you guys do that with those. Um so so I I kind of quit cross stitching for a little while and Oh really? I did. Because you opened the store. <laughs> <laughs> so but then so I decided I really I miss that. I love that. I it, so I'm gonna get back into this. So I come down. Mm -hmm. I buy the 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 one with the ABCs on it. Those yeah. cute little houses. Mm -hmm. The isn't that a little house? Yeah, it is. Okay, so there's nine of them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna do that on a 36 count. Oh, <laughs> I'm blind, you guys. I can't. <laughs> so and. Step further. I'm going to take this on the airplane with oh, me, and no. I'm going to stitch going to Chicago. No, no, no. I think I had on two pairs of glasses on the airplane. It's not one, two. And so we start going up, and one of my pairs of glasses flips off my face, oh. strikes down the aisle. So I took off my seatbelt, and I'm going to go find my glasses because you can't. No, no. I so, bet you got in trouble. I heard you tap them and say, oh, no, so no, I don't know. <laughs> you were I, sneaky. I was, but that was my foray back into. There are easier methods to get back into crafts. Yeah, don't. <laughs> Especially if you're. Try those big Santas. Age, of a mature age, and your eyesight is. It's strong. not what you thought it <laughs> should be. <laughs> but I love how it looks. Yeah, I pretty. love linens. I love the smaller count. I love that you can't see all the holes. You just see this beautiful picture mm -hmm. stitched out on it. I. I do. I love the smaller count. So I just use my magnifier and two pairs of glasses sometimes, whatever it takes to get. Sometimes it's right here, and I'm hoping I'm not poking my eyeballs when I'm doing it. But I, I love this. I want you to flip around because you have to see these. Look at these beautiful little pin cushions. And these are all Shepherd's Bush designs, and they have amazing little kits right here inside of their little cupboard. Look at this. Here's all of your fun little kits, all ready, prepared for you again. So your floss is in there, your stitching fabric, and your back. Everything is in there. If they've got the beautiful little ribbons or the chenille, whatever, the little pom-poms, whatever's on there for their little trim, they include that in their kits. I love how they've done their kits. Okay. Aren't they? I just think they're beautiful. Look at those little sheets. I know. Aren't they gorgeous? I mean, look, look at this one. Look at how beautiful this one is. So of course I love houses. Sheets. I do too. Houses do and too. flags are kind of my thing. Well, there you go. In the I right think section. you will notice. Yeah. I do you put a sheep on every single one of your designs? No, but, but pretty lot. close, yeah, huh? Yeah, lot. pretty close. So they're so beautiful. So what do we have over in this section, ma'am? So we have our silk threads, overdyed silk, and. Last time I was here, I purchased some silks to do a fun little cross stitch, but I haven't actually used them yet. So are there any tips in using silk threads? Um, just make sure your hands aren't snaggy. <laughs> so oh, so lotion. lotion them up good yeah. first. And then, you know, use stitcher's lotion so it doesn't leave a residue on your silk threads. Okay. Because that'll drive you crazy if your head, fingers are snaggy because the silk snags. But it is beautiful to work with. And... And you use just usually one strand because it's a little bit loftier than nice. other threads, so you can get by with one strand. But they come in gorgeous colors. They do come. So on the silk threads, are they? Is there just like maybe a little more shine, a little more I don't know. spark, a little, bit maybe, little bit maybe? Not so much. Not so much. It's just pretty to use. It, it is. It's beautiful. So we carry Gloriana and um, Thread Gatherer from Boise. Nice. That's a and then Bell's Law, which is um, Arizona. Nice. 
great selections. Oh, and uh, water lilies and nice. We said we had a lot of threads. <laughs> they have a lot of threads because you need a lot of threads. Yes. If you're doing wool embroidery, we have lots of great threads mm -hmm. that work super for that. Yes, yes. Oh, look at all And then a little bit of fabric. And there's their Nothing little... compared to <laughs> <laughs> But these yeah. ones would specifically go with the kits that you have, correct? Correct. Mm -hmm. So I... I only order things that I think are going to work for either the stockings or for pillows or nice. so so when you want a variety you go to friends <laughs> we'll help you out. We'll, we can help if you, you out. want stuff for a pillow or a stocking we're we, here we've got we're that here. oh I like this little guy he looks doable right there <laughs> <laughs> so here's another tiny town Okay. Oh, this is the honey of a tiny that's town. So oh, cute. Isn't that adorable? That is real. And I like how you framed them. Because they, they, don't they show them? Um, yeah, they all show them on a drum. In a drum. I haven't ever tried a drum. So, but I love, I, and did, did you get up close so you could see the frame? So oh, look yeah, the, let's, look, let's look at the frame. Look yes. at that. Our framer frame. does it really oh, sharp does. frames look for that. this. Year. Well, she does not for everything. Look at the beautiful. frame on five rules. That's that. amazing. Isn't that does she pretty? paint them? Mm -hmm. She does. Oh, my gosh. Look yeah. at this beautiful one over here. And then, my and then the says, mat is painted on this that one. Gorgeous? That's amazing. Sometimes yeah, she paints she the frame. Sometimes she paints the mat. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. I would rather be stitching. Of course we would. We should hang that in the laundry room. We I would should. rather be we stitching. Should. In the kitchen, the laundry room, anywhere. anywhere. Oh, it's all so lovely. I don't think we've shown this wall yet. So show this beautiful wall of what they do for us as well. So then the fabrics we try to chop up into smaller pieces so that if you're in a hurry or you want a small piece, these are the Aidas. So 14, 16, 18. And then we have to oh, around yeah. behind you. Okay, these well, which way should we so go? Right here, because you're going to come down this so way. So 28 and linens. Down and then my 32 linens are looking a little sparse, so I'm working on that today, filling them up. Good girl. And then okay. there's this whole wall. So, over but look here. at the amount of colors. I mean, there's this. just so are many they options. Gorgeous. Don't go into the toilet. I won't. You can see a, <laughs> a little tiny hint of what used to be the toy room, but. During COVID, we needed Cute. to space everyone, so mm -hmm. it became Rita's workspace, office, and it has never gone back. <laughs> Good for our Rita. It. Good for our Rita. I want to work in a Rita. toy room. Yeah. Yeah. Look, Look, at Rita. <laughs> Look at that cute sparkle. Yeah, she likes being in. She calls it the zoo. The zoo. It's really a <laughs> but it's so it's so good. But we all love it. Did we catch everything? I think so. Probably. Not. I don't think we got these fun Probably the Halloween pillows not. up there. Yeah, there's no way we could catch everything. Oh, gosh, You're no. right. Oh gosh, no. There, I I can come in here, spend hours, which I love to do, and still not feel like I've seen everything because there's so many beautiful things. Come look over here. Look at all of these fun little things. We've got charms. We have all kinds of fun. Look, look at how beautiful is that? Isn't that a pretty little stitch? And look at the frame on that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. And look at all of the fun That's little. That's a whiff needle thread. Is that? It's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh. This is kind of our little junky accessory section. But oh, these are nice. Yeah, Tell us great. about these. Tell us, please. So and these... I, would you know I would pick up a purple one? <laughs> <laughs> it is your favorite purple. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you did not pick up the red one. It's just the one that we have. But I bought the red one from you. <laughs> <laughs> so these are little magnetic boxes that you can keep all of your supplies in. So instead of digging to the bottom of your bag, you have them in a box. And I have a box for cross stitch, I have a box for wool embroidery, I have a box for quilting, so that, because they all take different they implements and tools. They do. And they take different things. So I have a little needle. Minder. Holder, minder. Mm -hmm. um, it, it's nice. magnetic. This is a little threader, mm -hmm. then scissors. And they're magnetic top and bottom, so your needles can just stay there, too. Perfect. Because mm -hmm. there's no. nothing like losing a needle on an airplane. And they come in really fun Beautiful. little colors. Look at this fun little turquoise color. This is really a pretty one. So there's green and there's a navy. But isn't that a pretty That's color pretty. there? That's pretty. And the red. Yeah, they're just fun. Those are really fun little ones. You'll notice the pink is sold out. 
Darn. <laughs> I didn't buy the pink. I won't buy the purple. I did buy a red one from him, though. I'm, I'm full confession here. I did buy a red one. But come around this side and look at look at the needle mine. There's some really fun little needle minders over here. There's all oh, and these are kind of what you had on that, kind of similar to what you had on that mm -hmm. bag. We have all sorts of different. These are scissor fobs. And a gal in Texas makes them for us, and they're all different oh, they're ones. So or cute. we have the little leather ones that are just crazy and fun. Crazy fun. And some needle minders. And the needle minders are so much fun. Isn't this just the funnest store? Didn't you guys want this <laughs> And ribbons back oh, yeah. there. Oh, yeah, messy oh, back there. No. So when you get your bag, when you... They, they fix it up. So when you leave here, your bag is all tied up with one of their beautiful little ribbons. I know. You almost don't want to start because it's so cute. <laughs> it's I like think. opening a fat quarter bundle it, or a it, jelly roll. It's it, like, it, it, oh, it's so pretty. I can't use it. I can't do it. Did you show that? So is this one this year? That was last year's. This one was Hector. last year's. Hector was last year's stocking. Look at how stinking cute you mm. guys Oh, they're just so beautiful. I love the stockings. I'm going to make two. I'm gonna make... Did you show this beautiful cabinet right here with all the pretty scissors? So this is the cabinet that my grandmother that I inherited from my grandmother. And it was <gasps> white did. and gold. And I didn't love it. It sat in the basement for a long time. And then you I found a gal in Salt Lake that would paint them. And she had it for a year. And then oh. when I got it back, I was... Oh, because I just now love it. You can use yeah. it. And so we fill it with all sorts Look of really this. wonderful things. Really, really good things. things. Scissors. Um, all sorts of look, you got to come up here and look at all of these beautiful little tiny stitcheries that in little tarts. Look at how sweet that is. I love how you guys finish them in different ways. Like who would have thought put it in a little tart pan. Yeah, that's and fun. it's so cute. And the little wooden boxes up above boxes, it. The boxes, the little wooden trays. Yep, right oh, there. Thank you. So do you sell the little wooden boxes uh -huh. in that? Okay. Oh, nice. Yep. We sell the boxes. We sell the trays. Nice. Oh, it's so well, good. I yeah. hope that the only thing we've accomplished today is that you need to add this to your list of <laughs> places to come. Places uh. to visit. And, and maybe go to the cupcake shop. Or <laughs> go across the street or, to water for or, yeah, or Farms Ice Cream. Or oh that's yes, true. that's just down the road yeah. as well. So we, we have you have, we have some good things. Ogden is a fun little. It town. is a fun city, and it's getting better. You know, it used to be Ogden sometimes could be a little. When well, we first opened, yes, but it's gotten oh, fabulous. So oh, absolutely. Market. Oh yeah. On Saturdays, mm -hmm. it's mm -hmm. it's huge. Yeah, and all is. sorts of festivals, and it's a great well, little city. It is a great little city. My friend, thank you so <laughs> much for doing this for us. I You're always welcome. love to come and visit. It has been so fun. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And everybody, please make sure you come down and see these beautiful women that are here. They have great ladies that work with them. These two are always here. It's like, <laughs> we're always here. Always here. We're always Except here. Except for when we're at a wedding. <laughs> well, well, that, that, sometimes that happens. Sometimes we get to take a day off. Yes. But you will not yeah, be sorry coming. Fun. They have more stuff packed in this little building right here it's just there's there's it's just eye candy there's just something <laughs> for everybody to see and, and enjoy, we're just so. right on the way north to really yeah, yeah that's true come um, whichever way you're coming it's easy to hit us both in the same trip oh, well, thank you so much for doing oh, this for us this, this has been fun <laughs> So I think we've probably taken up our time. We appreciate everyone coming and joining us for this beautiful day. Thank you again so You're much, welcome. girls, for letting us come. Thank you. Thank you. Nice <laughs> you are so uh, well, no, you're so kind to let us come. <laughs> so thank you both very much. And so everybody, be kind to one another. Be really nice to yourself, and we'll see you next week. <laughs> and bye. Bye. And bye. bye. And quilt. And quilt. Thank you. <laughs>